Welcome back to CAD CAM tutorial. Today we are going to create a simple exercise for the beginners in SOLIDWORKS and here you will learn some basic features like extruded boss base, extruded cut, how to use rib tool. So let's make this simple exercise in SOLIDWORKS. Let's do again a simple exercise in SOLIDWORKS for beginners. So here this is the exercise. We are going with this circle or cylinder face. You will see 56 outer and 30 millimeter inside diameter and how long we need to extrude if we see here distance 28 plus 16 plus 7 28 even though you will see the dimension here 72 millimeter if you want to download this 2d drawing you can just simply go to our facebook page there you will get jpeg file so let's make this now first we need to choose any one plane or even though if you directly choose a sketch, it will ask you which plane. So I will choose right plane. Now let's activate circle. Click on origin point. And the outer diameter 56 enter. Now again select 30. Enter. Now right click select or simply press escape key to exit now exit sketch go to features and activate features extruded boss base now here we will keep end condition mid plane so that it's going to move in both side dimension 72 millimeter say yes now look now let's make this structure you will see 80 millimeter from center of the circle to this point corner there is a radius r8 and this one 48 millimeter okay the length 40 then 28 then here little upstairs then radius r8 16 millimeter 56 and how long this one we need to extrude you will see here 48 millimeter even though you will see 72 minus 12 minus 12 it's become 48 millimeter so let's i'll activate our right plane a sketch let's select line go back to this point again and see it's automatically going to convert into arc And again go to the point back and you will see again come down go back to the point and see it's automatically converted into R and connect with this point right click or escape click this one horizontal now we will define dimension to this so either you can create circle or simply select this outer circle convert entity see it is converted no need to draw a circle it is make sure in exact position now the first dimension i'll define radius 8 millimeter escape key and you here we will make one relation select this three arc make equal okay is activate smart dimension Eighty, forty-eight millimeter, forty millimeter, twenty-eight millimeter. Now this distance from here to here fifty-six millimeter. Now the gap between these two lines are sixteen millimeter. Now you will see the drawing is fully defined. Okay, here the relation is not perfectly defined. So I'll hold shift key, select these two points vertical. See, drawing is fully defined. So simply go to feature activate. Now here two close geometry. So it will ask you which you geometry you like to use. Otherwise, if I cancel normal view, 
and uh, go to sketch and activate trim entity power trim just move your left mouse press and drag see it's trimmed okay now i'll activate extruded boss base now here see it is asking it is directly took no need to choose anything and condition mid plane now if you minus 12 mm is 48 mm so the center distance 48 mm say yes now let's add this circle this circle actually located at the center of this rectangle is not mention here but 30 16 mm and 70 mm 40 mm height and there is one more rib 10 mm and the distance if you see 20 mm from this cut out so first we will make this cut out 28 mm 16 mm thick then this one then this rib okay let's make this cut out a sketch now activate corner rectangle let's say i'll activate okay now let's define this 16 mm from this end to this end 28 mm okay and from center point to outer edge 28 yes now go to feature activate extruded cut tool and here choose end condition through all look yes see it's going to cut up to the end i'll choose this face a sketch circle i'll draw circle 30 16 now here we need to define relation so i'll find midpoint hold shift key and center point vertical relation in the same way i'll find the midpoint of this line hold shift key horizontal see activate extruded boss base feature and keep end condition 40 mm say yes right plane sketch i'll choose line now we want to act make a rib so i'll select this end point exit <coughs> if i am going to choose the distance between these two lines it's 20 now drawing is fully defined if i am going to activate rib tool 10 mm i'll keep mid both side thickness and direction is perfectly down to this say yes but here you will see error because this is circular face you need to little extend inside so i'll cancel i'll take normal again go to feature and i'll choose line and i'll little extend let's say 1 mm any dimensions just uh, is not it should not disturb the inside circle now now let's activate rib 10 mm thickness both sides say yes now look due to this point this rib it's difficult to create rib on this that's why we or uh, we need to little extend inside so this is the our simple tutorial for the beginners i hope you like it don't forget to share like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solidworks thanks for watching